Well, hey, about an early Thursday morning. Uh, come out here to see some puppies. Oh, that's Mr. Blue. He's my last available older boy, 13 weeks old. Mr. Green, he got off the porch and went right on down the road to Virginia. Yeah, he did. Yep. And uh, that's my older girl puppy there. She's still available. She was born in February. She almost got a ride to go with uh, Mr. Green, but... They decided they better they better focus on one dog, which I completely understand. But look, we come out here to see the blues, the blues and Mr. Red. Yeah, there's uh there's Mr. Red and Mr. Blue with Christmas right there, right there, and heaven at it, and little Mr. Blue over there. So folks are like, uh, so who would you pick? Well, I pick all of my Airedales based on the way they look. And, uh, yeah, because for me at least, I was getting them at eight weeks old. I knew they was Airedales. I knew what an Airedale was going to give me personality-wise, or at least I felt like I could. And I've always been more of a nurture than a nature kind of guy. So I felt like uh, I was going to raise my puppy to be the personality I wanted my puppy to be. So... I figured if I got one that I liked the way it looked, then I would never be disappointed. Because at least I'd have me a good looking dog. So, uh, I don't know. That little boy right there, I, I might pick him just on account of he probably saved me some money over the years in food bills. He's got to be able to eat less. I don't think he's going to catch up with either of them two other beasties. Puppy, leave that dog alone. <laughs> what are you trying to do? <laughs> That's a good potty. Thank you, little boy. Had a good pop, 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 pop. Uh, I don't know though. Mr. Blue with Christmas has such a pretty swagger. You know, just like the way he uh he prances, like the way he walks. I don't know. Gee whiz. I I don't know. I don't know. Who wants who wants to go home with Ben? Well, you're already home, but you know what I mean. Who wants who? I think it's gonna be between the two blues. And don't ask me why I'm rejecting Mr. Red. I ain't got a good reason. But I'm uh I'm thinking it's gonna be one of the two blues. So which blue? I don't know. I don't have to pick today. Because it's only Thursday. And uh, puppy pick with day ain't until Christmas Eve. So, what? <laughs> so, so, I'm going to keep my eyes open. I'm going to keep looking. I'm going to keep looking. Do you do you want to go home with me? Huh? Yeah, you better get your hand off of me. How about that? Okay, boss. All right. All right. Mr. Red. Yeah, I don't know, Mr. Red. What? Yeah. So, anyhow, this morning... I'm thinking little Mr. Blue. Later on, I might change my mind. But if I ha oh, where are you going there, Boggs? Where are you going? What wrong? Oh, no, you're too young to get off of that porch. Come here, you beast. Come here, Mr. Red. Go on up there. I know, I know that dog enticed you off the porch. You're like, I didn't know. All right, so anyhow, let me go get some brothers and sisters out here and see, uh, hey, you. What are you chewing? What are you chewing? What are you chewing? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I don't know. He's a cutie. All right, folks. Let me uh, let me go get them other dogs out here. Uh, uh, both of them girls have been reserved. So Tilly and uh, and I don't know what that other dog's name is yet, but she's uh, she's got her a home. So, but I'm gonna bring them all out here. I just wanted to spend some time with these three. You, hey now, you, you, come here, you beast. Come here, you beast. Come here. You, yeah, yeah, you, I'm talking to you. Yeah, I'm talking to you. You, you what? Yeah, I'm talking to you. All right, folks, talk to you next time.